What's up guys, IBKing1 here, and today I'll be reviewing the Able Planet True Fiddlety NC300W. These noise cancelling headphones. Um, I'll be over going over the three things. First, built quality. Second, sound quality. And I'll go over some of the accessories that came along with this headphone. Also, in the end, for uh, bass heads out there, I'll show you guys how good uh, the bass quality on these are. So, let me just go over the headphones real quick. Uh, right there, on the right side, right there, there's the switch to turn on and off the noise cancelling uh, there are four holes where the headphone listens so these holes is where the headphone listen to cancel the noise that's around you so there's two on top and two on bottom there's a 3.5 millimeter uh, earphone jack and on the right top side Here's the where you put your AAA battery. So, built quality. Um, these are made out of hard, durable plastic. Um, the, this isn't cheap stuff. This is actually real good quality. And it has a steel frame inside. So, you know, bend really wide. It's not frustrating at all. And the uh, pads on these are very comfortable. These leather like materials, they're strong, durable. It's also on the top. Um,. Yeah, so that goes to the build quality, you guys. Nice, strong headphones. Like it. Second, sound quality. Um, these are really nice headphones. Um, I believe they have a frequency from 20 hertz to 20,000 hertz. Yep. And sensitivities at 115. DB when it's off and with when you turn the noise cancelling on the sensitivity is at 121 DB uh, there is a huge difference when you turn the noise cancelling on and off when I leave it off uh, the sound like when I'm listening to music it's the I hear it like the vocals low I can't really hear it that loud so usually I have to turn the volume a little up to hear it, but when I turn the noise cancelling on, when I'm at that low volume, I still could hear the vocals fine, and uh, it, usually it, the music gets loud when I turn the noise cancelling off. So yeah, and for noise cancelling wise, uh, these are pretty nice noise cancelling headphones. Um, if I I didn't mention in the beginning, but I used to have the Beats uh, Studios. I sold these a month ago, that and I got these. Uh, these are like the Beats are like three hundred dollars, and these I got these off Amazon for a hundred dollars, and they have similar sound quality. Many of you guys on my unboxing video asked me how you compare these to the beats well sound quality wise they're pretty similar but noise cancelling wise the able planets are way better than the beats and beats uh, they take two AAA batteries and you have to turn the noise cancelling on to listen to music so that's you know using your battery but these you could leave it on or off and you still could listen to music. 
So that's an upside for this here. So and back to the able planets. So yeah, these have nice um sound quality. Uh everything else seems pretty balanced, but the bass I do get a little heavier bass on these. These have uh thirty millimeter drivers I think. And these do everything's balanced but bass is a little high. So for bass heads out there, you know, these are the headphones for you guys. Um, the accessories that came with this is a four feet long cable with um, volume control. This plastic right here is the same quality as the one on the headphone, so this is very durable too. And this isn't cheap stuff. Uh. 4th inch stereo adapter uh, airplane adapter and if you guys notice all of these are gold plated so you know these are high quality even on the headphones right here it's gold plated and it came with this hard case box case right here put your headphones in there and your accessories in there Nice, ready to go. Um, I'm currently. Um, some of you guys asked me if you know if you use a different cable other than these. I'm currently using these right now, and I get the same same sound quality. Uh, these are like three feet long. I prefer the shorter ones. The the one that came with is four feet long, and they're a little too long, so I prefer using these. And I'm using these right now, and I get the same sound quality. Uh, for comfort-wise, uh, compared to the Beats, um, I know many of you guys have probably seen the Beats Studios. Uh, I don't have them right now with me because I sold them. That's why I got these. But I still have the box with me. I don't know why, but <laughs> uh, if you look at the design. Um, it does the. It's not like a closed design like the Able Planet. See how it closes. But these, they don't. So when, like how these close, there's pressure when you put these on. So it is pressing in your head, but the pads, you know, they they are comfortable, but you know they get pressed down and it. Well, when you you know like have these on for uh, over an hour it does get pretty uncomfortable and because it's pressing down on against your head uh, it does get hot so comfort wise uh, the beats are much more comfortable but you know for your price I you know for the sound quality I definitely prefer these over the beats but you know if you guys want to pay in an extra two hundred dollars then you could get the beats and you know if you guys are in for style hanging by the neck or something go around school these are definitely not to hang around your neck because like I said these are clothes you know unless you don't want to choke yourself you can't hang these by your necks but the beats you could and the beats do have you know better looking than these these aren't that bad looking but perfect you know nice strong so overall great headphones I really like the on and off feature unlike the beats alright for last for you bass heads out there uh, I'll just show you guys how the bass is on this have this Beats audio software in my laptop um if you guys can see right here my camera could focus 
See right here? I put base all the way on top and everything to zero. So this is on full base right now. And I put the volume all the way up on high. Now, I'm gonna turn on six foot, seven foot by Lil Wayne. Cause this song has a high deep bass. And I thought it'd be perfect for the bass test. Turn this on. If you guys hear that, that's not you know the sound of the song is the sound of the bass so these have crazy bass like the headphones are like vibrating they're vibrating crazy and see how I said closed when I open it closed And also, like I said, when the sound gets loud when I turn the volume control off. You see that? Everything goes down when I turn the volume control off. I guess it has to do with the sensitivity. So yeah, these are pretty perfect for bass heads out there. Got these uh, hundred dollars at Amazon with shipping. All right. Overall, you know this is a nice headphone for the price too. You know you get the same sound quality, pretty much very similar sound quality as the Beat Studio. If you guys are looking for a, a, like a, something that's close to the Beat Studios, I highly recommend these. The design may not be like the Beats, but in sound quality wise, and if you guys want the bass like the Beat Studio, these are perfect. Also, these have noise cancelling headphones. These are noise cancelling headphones. You guys can't get... Well, Oh, yeah, when I block this hole right here, see that? Makes that noise. I don't know why it's doing that, but it does that. But, anyways, back to the point. Yeah, at $100 and getting the noise canceling headphone, this is a really good price. So, overall, you know, this is a pretty nice headphone. The only thing I found cheap is the box and on the right side of the box there's this pixelated picture of this guy and they just pasted a, the picture of the headphone and that this picture looks pretty cheap. Others, you know, these are high quality pictures but this is all pixelated and they just pasted this headphone on the guy. Other than that it's not a big deal, it's just a box, but other than that, oh, got that. Other than that, nice headphones. You know, this is a good headphone. Thanks for watching my video. You know, please like. And if you guys have any questions about the headphones, feel free to leave a comment or two. I'll reply ASAP. And thanks for watching my video, you guys.